Hi everybody, this is um, just another quick test. In my last uh, video that's um, just gone up, I showed you the the 12 volt power supply that I'd wired into the battery. I've since replaced the battery and um, while I was there I located a wiring loom going to the rear of the bike that um, holds the, um, the wires for the tail lights um, and so forth at the back of the bike and I found a hot wire that is live while the key's on and um, when the key's not on it's not live anymore so I've wired the 12 volt power supply into that so um, I've got a, a good supply of power for the <coughs> GPS now um, the GPS I've moved from my tank bag which is not here right now and I've put it over here on the windshield and it gives it some weather protection and stuff like that I've actually got a waterproof um, case for the GPS but it, um, it's this one here and um, it's got the wrong mounts on it what I do need or what I would like to get is a fork yoke stem mount which goes down here on the um, on the fork stem there uh, which looks like this so this is a test to see um, how all that's going to work um, I've just moved it back down a little bit on the windscreen there because it was vibrating a bit up, up this end and um, where it is now I can sort of make out the fuel gauge which is okay I can deal with that it covers the neutral light the stand light and the turn signals and so I just have to be oh still got my turn signal on you see I didn't I didn't see that so I've got to be very conscious of um, my turn signals um, still being on and um, also in my last video I said that <coughs> because of longevity issues um, what I was going to do is drop the resolution down to 720p um, because I only had a 32 gig SD card um, I've since purchased two 64 gig SD cards so back up at its highest setting for this camera it's an AS20 Sony AS20 um, at 120p 60 frames per second um, with the 64 gig cards in it gives me five and a half hours footage time so um, I've got two of those cards so that will give me enough footage time throughout the day to um, dump the footage to a laptop while I'm heading up north so um, so that's that sorted out and um, I've also purchased from China they arrived just the other day two 15,000 uh, milliamp hour power banks and um, as part of this test um, I've got no battery in my camera right now it's running directly off a power supply which is sitting in my breast pocket right now so um, there's no battery in the camera it's just running directly off the power bank when I'm when I'm doing my ride my big big ride is going to be just next week um, I'm going to have a battery in there anyway which will be charging that as well as running off the power bank so I can basically have the camera powered all day and um, with the 64 gig SD cards I can not worry about it filling up and running out of space and stuff like that so I can sort of almost be like a, a black box as well for the whole trip um, So that's all getting underway just next week. So um, everything seems to be working okay at the moment. Um, 
I've checked the oil, I've checked the coolant, I've checked the brake fluid, um, I've got a brand new Warren of Fitness, or as they call it, MOT in, in U the UK. Um, got brand new registration. All I have left to do now is um, to check the tyre pressures, which I'll do just before I go. And on this bike it's um, 36 psi in the front, 42 in the back. So um, I'll do that just before I go. Um, and by the time this video goes live, um, I will actually be on my second day of this ride. So this ride that I'm doing just next week, today's Friday, so Friday next week is when we leave. It's going to be something like 1750. Sorry about that pause, I just heard a funny sound, but it's actually the braking system of that truck in front of me. Um, yeah, so it's going to be a great big, huge long ride, 1750 kilometres. And um, everything seems to be working, everything's um, all current and legal registration, warrant, um, brake fluid, coolant, oil. I'll do the tire pressure just before I go. It's got to be mindful of these turn signals hidden behind there. And um, yeah, so thank you for joining me on this ride. Tell your mates to watch this channel. Um, so really looking forward to this big long ride right up to the very tip of the North Island, Cape Reinga. Um, if you go beyond there, you end up in Fiji or New Caledonia or somewhere. So thank you for watching and um, stay tuned.